Shizu Abe died after being shot by an unemployed man. The former Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has died after being shot while making a campaign speech, plunging the country into grief as it comes to terms with the loss of its longest-serving leader. Abe became Japan's longest-serving premier in November 2019, but by the summer of 2020, public support had been eroded by his handling of the COVID-19 outbreak as well as a series of scandals, including the arrest of his former justice minister. The 67-year-old, who resigned in 2020, was flown to hospital by helicopter after the attack in the western city of Nara and pronounced dead about five and a half hours later. The first assassination of a sitting of former Japanese premier since the days of pre-war militarism in the 1930s sent shock waves through Japan, where political violence is rare and guns are tightly controlled. Police said a 41-year-old unemployed man, Tetsuya Yamagami, was apprehended at the site and had admitted to shooting the former prime minister with a homemade weapon. The public broadcaster NHK quoted Yamagami as telling police he was dissatisfied with Abe and wanted to kill him. Yamagami told police he had made multiple handmade explosives and guns in the past. Police discovered several possible explosive devices during a search of his home, according to local media. Bomb disposal technicians were preparing to carry out a controlled explosion on the premises. The hospital that tried to save him said he died at 3 past 5 p.m. He bled to death from deep wounds to the heart and the right side of his neck, despite receiving more than 100 units of blood in transfusions over four hours. Hide Tada Fukushima, the professor in charge of emergency medicine at Nara Medical University Hospital, said, This is BBS News, a channel that provides you with the hottest and latest news. Thank you for listening and see you in the next videos.